Good Friday. Let's rip in. Okay. So what are we up to? We're doing this second build. Uh, let's just have a listen with the Batman riser again. the cutoff maybe just a little bit more pluck sound in there now so i'm gonna go for the audio react wavetable banks which are awesome uh, i'll just go to audio loop so i can have a listen to which kind of one that i want just for shits and giggles let me put this in there and see how it sounds Something, something like that. That's what I'm seeing in my head, but I just don't know. Oh, something like that. And then... Hmm.
What are we? Keys number eight. Keys number three. go for let's go for vital let's see what we got i do like vital and i feel like having a bit of a play around with it Definitely more in the style that we want, so. cheat you can turn the scale on and do that and i probably should do that but i just sometimes like to go a bit crazy and see how we go
like that. I'm going to save that for something else though. So I'm going to drag that to my folder of shit that I have saved because I really like that. Uh, Synthrax saved. Have I got anything in here? No, not really. Nope. Okay. Uh, oh, please don't steal my MIDI. <laughs> no, I'll go nuts. I'll probably end up changing it quite a bit anyway and make it a little less repetitive, but it's a nice way to get going. This spits this to MIDI. I bet you 50 bucks it won't though. 303 riff. Not one singular note, bastard. Ah, oh, it's always the way. can do then. So did it did it. The last one's up an octave. If I copy the MIDI then I might be able to come up with something pretty cool. something a bit more rhythmic to the arpeggiation of the acid so it's just lingering a bit more track definitely on the right track it's not a hundred percent obviously i'm gonna have to spend quite a bit of time i think we'll spend a, a few days on this bad boy but you've just got to start somewhere and then base the ideas you know you, you just got to put pen to paper like i was saying yesterday you've just got to put pen to paper to kind of make the inspiration come about it's not just going to happen for you i don't know sometimes i'm at work and i do go oh my god that'll sound mad that melody if i do it this way and then nine times out of ten i try it and then i end up going on a bit of a different path with it and it works but yeah i think like you've just gotta you've just gotta start writing the melody you just have to you've got to start writing and then see where it takes you and see what works around the other elements and and then really decide what's what's going to hit and what's not 
Ah, how good's coffee? So. Make it a bit more. Yeah, I like that. Yes. Do a little change there. Okay. Okay. Yes, can do. And then another resolution over here, which could be. Uh, I'll put the groove on it too. Uh, let's go Furion. Oh. the last note need to figure out another resolution but you know that's it's a good starting point it really is it's not too crazy it's fairly easy to remember you always want to try and keep melodies nice and simple and it's not what you use but how you use it it, it comes down to note placement as well as um, the message you're trying to get across don't go too cheesy don't go too overboard either you know like um one of the expressions I love using most with people I teach and in general is KISS, which is keep it simple, stupid. Just really like hone in on making it simple so that it's like, um, prime example is like uh, when I think of like Britney Spears, that toxic song, that nee, 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 nee. It's so freaking annoying, but it always sticks in your head. That little hook. Nee, 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 nee. God, I hate it. But it like, I always remember it because it's just like so annoyingly, predominant <laughs> like it's just such a um distinct sound that always just lingers around in the brain well for me anyway it does so whatever it is try and try and keep it as something that resonates with people whether it be positive or negative unfortunately that one for me is pretty negative i don't hate the song i think it's you know not bad but i just hate how catchy that stupid hook is but it, yeah it, it's doing its job which is the most important thing you always want something to remember the track by just a bit of a hook so it's got to it's got to have that um a bit of that wow factor going on so yeah guys thank you so much and i'll see you tomorrow to continue